I have finally crowned my E. I'm guessing she's gonna be doing a lot of damage, right? Okay, we're gonna go around the world and farm things with Yaimiko, okay? Yaimiko with Kazuha, Bennett, and Kujosara. We're gonna see how much damage she's going to do with her E, okay? We might be able to see the damage difference. Okay, we are looking at 32k. I wonder if crowning my Kujosara's E would also help me do more damage with my Yaimiko. But it wouldn't be so much, right? From 82% to whatever, like maybe 90%. It's not much. Okay, now we go to Asdaha's domain. Here we go. That's a 135k, right? 135k each E. Now, I don't have anywhere else to showcase Yaimiko's damage. That's too much, right? We can uh, perhaps take her to Storm Terror, right? This is where a lot of people found Yaimiko very glitchy, right? But I have a solution for you guys. Before you put down your E, right? Just take all those Anemo thingy that creates the wind current, right? Just do that and you're good. Okay, we take these. We take these, right? Oh no. Take these. And then it's finally going to attack the Valen. Yeah? <laughs> you know, if there's a problem, just solve it yourself. Because Mihoyo is not going to solve it for you, right? So uh, just pick up those shit. Because the, the turret seems to attack that. They prioritize this more than the valid. So. Okay, we are going to take Yaimiko to the wolf. And then because Yaimiko has like four strikes, right? There is no way we can actually one shot this wolf boss. So sadly, we're just gonna use our turret, okay? This is a crowned E showcase, anyways. It's gonna run away in no time. <laughs> Where are you going, Doggo? Oh! He's getting attacked! He is getting attacked! Look at that! He is getting attacked! <laughs> okay, let me see if I can... Let's use Q. Ah, he's immune! He's right now immune! But... Let's... Let's walk. Oh, I wanted to just walk away like a bouse. And then just... Just watch him die. But that didn't work out, but hey. Okay, guys, we're going to Ocean it. This is where I happen to suffer a lot in early game. This bird, yes, I will make sure to f*** this bird really, really hard, okay? This is for my chat. Look at this shit. He's getting attacked. And I really, I, I really think it's so weird for Ocean it to get a voiceover. Why, why does she all of a sudden get a voiceover? You know what they should do? They should give voiceover to a f***ing cryo resist fine. Or pyro resist fine, dude. They don't talk! Why can't plants talk? I want a talking plants! This is Genshin Impact, yeah? Well, it's a lot boring than I think. <laughs> I want to see a flying bird. Okay, thank you. Flying bird already died. Bye. Alright, that's it for uh, Ocean Edge Showcase, I guess. Why don't I take you guys to uh, Masanori? Okay, so a uh, little tip for those of you guys who think Masanori is too weak. You set your clock 
to be 0 o'clock and talk to him. He has more HP at night, right? He becomes a s machine. Why did he become invincible for a, for a second? Why was, why was that? There is nowhere for me to uh, showcase this. Did I put down two turrets? I think I did. Nice. There was some auto farm, right? <sighs> Stop. Alright, that's gonna be good. Watch this one. This is gonna be great. Can we uh, possibly one shot her? <laughs> she I framed. But I hope this turret follows her, and there we go. That was a good showcase. That was satisfying, dude. Oh my god! I couldn't even get to Yai Miko! <laughs> Not strong enough. We're gonna move on. Actually, shall we go to that little weird lizard place? Wouldn't that be better? Okay, this is going to be our last place to showcase Yaimiko. To be honest, I would say that among all the other C6 characters I have, Yaimiko is one of the best. In terms of damage, in terms of, I guess, well, because I see a huge number, right? It's fun for me. Can you jump? That's perfect. Okay, there you go. Mmm. Mmm. Juicy. That was good. I didn't use my Kujusara's Q. Instead, I used my E. So that I don't do too much damage. I had a feeling. That would be a... <laughs> that my Kujusara might be able to one-shot them. And then... If that's the case, then it's not going to be Yaimiko Showcase. It's going to be Kujosara Showcase. You know what I mean? So anyways, so we did take Yaimiko around and did some damage showcase, right? And as you can see, you are definitely using Yaimiko as a main DPS in here. Now that the Yaimiko banner is over, right? I can let you know that Yaimiko, I have no regrets for spending money on Yaimiko. Probably one of the strongest characters that are out right now. You know, I'm a lazy person, right? When I see a monster sitting on top of a mountain, I don't want to climb up. But if you have Yaimiko, then you can just place down your turret and then it's going to be dead. I hope uh, the C6 R5 showcase kind of gave you a little chills, you know, gave you an idea of what it's going to be like if you actually had C6 R5 Yaimiko. Anyways, thank you so much for watching this video. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe to my channel. I'll see you guys next time. Adios.